Hi, this is Stephen Colley from Trotec Laser Technical. I'm going to show you some tips and tricks on your Trotec. Now, this video will showcase the unboxing of the Speedy 360 and 400 laser machines. Most systems are delivered via freight and can be offloaded using a lift gate to your home or office. These laser machines will come in a large wood reinformed box on a wooden pallet. When received, give the new system a walk around. Looking for any significant shipping damage, it is expected to see minor scuffs on the box from the freight process. In addition to this video, should you like a simple unboxing process, you can also scan the QR code on each side of the box. This QR code will take you to simplified written unboxing instructions or just continue with this video. The only tools needed to unbox this laser machine are either a pair of scissors or a utility knife. To get started, first cut the two banding straps on the box. Locate four white twist clips on each of the box's long sides. They release the box sides. Rotate clockwise until it pulls free. Repeat this four times until they are all removed. Use a utility knife or scissors to cut any tape holding the box top to the sides. Then remove the box top and set it aside. Remove each box's sides, lifting them up and out and setting them aside. Remove any extra supports, then lift up on the wooden top frame to remove it, setting it aside. Next, use scissors or a utility knife to cut away the plastic. Note that the plastic will be under the wheels and the machine that is held in place on blocks. You will need to cut around the base of the machine, removing as much plastic as possible. Next, the blocks need to be removed from under the heavy machine. This process will be accomplished with the included ramps located under the machine. Slide out one of the two ramps, then pull out the second ramp, partially with it facing up as shown here. Use the second ramp and slide it under the machine to create a lever to lift one side of the laser machine. This process may require a second person. Push down on the ramp lever, gently lifting the machine, and then pull out the two blocks under that machine side. Now remove both ramps, go to the other side, and repeat the process, removing all four large wooden blocks on this Speedy 400 laser machine. For the Speedy 360 laser machine, uh, the blocks are positioned differently on the front and back of the machine. The removal process is the same for this machine, using the ramps to create a lever to then pull each of the blocks from under this model machine. This is the only difference in the unboxing process versus the Speedy 400. Once all the blocks are removed, position the ramps on one side of the machine as shown so that they are tight against the pallet base. These ramps are designed to make it easy to roll the laser machine off the base. This next step is optional if unloading the laser with no additional people to help. Locate a couple of screws and a screw gun or screwdriver. These are not provided. Place a screw into each side of the ramps as shown here. This will provide reassurance that the ramps will not move during the offloading process and is recommended if offloading yourself. The laser machine is now ready to be unloaded from the pallet. Unlock the two locked wheels at the front of the machine. Ensure there is a clear path at the base of the ramps for the machine to be safely offloaded. To confirm a secure and controlled operation while moving the machine towards the ramps, it is crucial to align the wheels properly before gently guiding the machine down the ramps. The force of gravity will assist in the descent. For optimal safety, it is advisable to have a person stationed on each side of the machini to oversee the process. While it is feasible to conduct this task solo, please be aware that doing so significantly increases the risk. Therefore, it is strongly recommended to involve multiple individuals when possible. Once the laser is removed, remove all the protective plastic and tape from the top and sides to open the top and front doors. Open the laser machine. Inside the machine will be a red accessory box included. This box includes an included lens cleaning kit with lens tissue and a bottle of optical lens and mirror cleaner. A speedy run on Ruby, quick reference guidebook, an ethernet cable, a set of metric hex keys. The laser machine nozzles with a wide and narrow version and the lens collar, the included lens kit. This may vary based on what is ordered. The keys to activate the laser. 
And lastly, the power cord for the machine. Additionally, a sheet of trolllace plastic will be inside the machine to calibrate the laser machine's overhead camera. The laser machine is now ready for installation. Thanks for watching this video and don't forget to like and subscribe and if you have any questions or comments, please leave them down below.